from a private movie theater to a rooftop terrace with Manhattan views. You could smell the sea breeze. We're exploring some of the most high-end pieces of real estate the Tri-State has to offer. Welcome to the Hayfields Estate. That includes a property in New Jersey that sits on 50 acres of land and a beach house on Long Island that's so chic it was featured on the show Rescue. It had its moment, its star moment. And welcome to Luxury Living, I'm Ty Milburn. Now over the next half hour, we'll travel the Tri-State touring some jaw-dropping properties that feature the simply finer things in life. We begin right here in the Hudson Valley with a lakeside mansion that was built way back in the 1800s. But as you'll see, there is nothing old about this very luxe estate. Welcome to Mayapak in this nearly 10,000 square foot lakefront mansion. The completely renovated historic Federalist House has a lot to offer. Eight bedrooms, nine and a half bathrooms, a gym, a movie theater, and water views from just about every room in the house. Hi, I'm Amy Schur. Welcome to Lake Mayo Pack. And we started the tour in the main living room. So Amy, this house has quite a history. It does. It was built in 1885. It was the first house on Lake Mayo Pack. The owners took the original structure, took a lot of it down, but then they completely rebuilt it up and it's luxe beyond luxe. The feel I get for this house is it's a brownstone on a lake, yet has a Hamptons feel, right? That, that's absolutely right. So uh, the homeowners actually have spent a lot of time in the Hamptons, so you're going to see that expressed throughout the house in the colors, the way it's designed. It's very open and airy and sunny and bright. And uh, you're going to see a lot of coffered ceilings and a lot of the same detail that you'll see in a townhouse. What I most appreciate about this property is the craftsmanship and the attention to detail. Yeah, the homeowners, when they did their renovation, they spared no expense, which is obvious, but they really kept a more traditional feel to the property. Um, for me personally, because I grew up on the water, I love the indoor-outdoor aspect of the property. I love that you have the kitchen and the dining room and everything leading right out to a terrace with the swimming pool and the water beyond that. You can't find that everywhere. And speaking of lake views, let's go and check it out. The house was, is obviously lovely, but, but this really feels like the main attraction. It is. I mean, this is what it's all about. And this is where you're getting the best of both worlds. You've got this beautiful property that's extremely livable, fantastic for entertaining. You've got Lake Mayo Pack. You've got over 200 feet on the lake, 100 foot dock, pool, hot tub, outdoor kitchen, tons of entertaining space. They've had some pretty nice parties here. Who do you imagine living in a place like this? Rich people. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Each week on Luxury Living, I typically choose my favorite room on the property. And this week was a bit hard because there were so many beautiful rooms to choose from. In the end, however, we settled in on the kitchen because this kitchen is everything any chef would love. It's open, it's clean, beautiful, and spacious. And the best part, perhaps, is that you stand at the sink and just take in the beautiful views of the lake. It turns out lake living does not come cheap. This property is currently on the market for six and a half million dollars. And now we're off to New Jersey to check out a home that's truly a must see. It's set on 50 acres overlooking rolling hills. And this home has a state of the art movie theater, a caterer's kitchen, and a two story great room. It is truly an entertainer's paradise. Take a ride down Spook Hollow Road in Bedminster, New Jersey, and feel like you've entered a whole new world. Set high overlooking the hills is an ultra luxe modern farmhouse resting on 50, yes, 50 sprawling acres. Welcome to the Hayfields Estate. Inside this 15,000 square foot home, you'll find eight bedrooms, 13 bathrooms, and a laundry list of over the top amenities. The estate was designed by renowned architect Alan Wanzenberg and interior designer Alexa Hampton, who worked on the White House Guest House back in 2018. You can tell a lot of people with a lot of love that put it all together um, and made it feel really like a genuine home. 
Built entirely from scratch, inside this house you'll find it all. A private state-of-the-art theater, an elevator, and the bar downstairs. Outside, the property boasts large patios, a pool house, a guest house, and of course, all of this beautiful land. That could include raising cattle, that could include having horse stables, and various different types of crops. Inside the family room, these grand scale windows bring the light outside in. That helps to showcase the timber details found in the floor and the ceiling. And it also highlights the heart of this room, this magnificent stone fireplace. Even though the rooms are large, it still feels cozy. And the spaces are very inviting. That's something you feel right away when you walk into the house. Now we head into the gourmet kitchen, which is both spacious and stylish. There's a large center island that's perfect for gathering. Or you can prep for the party in the butler's pantry. And the wall of windows illuminates the top of the line appliances, including the La Carneau stove. This is a handmade stove in France, and it is the Rolls Royce of stoves. After dinner, kick back and relax in this grand two-story great room. With this beautiful wrought iron staircase leading right up to the master suite. Custom beautiful wallpaper, this beautiful custom bed. As you could probably tell, this is her closet. And how's this for luxury? Forget about sharing. There are two master bathrooms right past the enormous walk-in closet. Which also leads to her master bathroom. A spa-like suite with white marble floors and countertops. With a, just an absolutely gorgeous view to the backyard. Then just steps away right past closet number two. And this is this gorgeous master bathroom with these beautiful Fior de Bosco gray marble slab floors with matching vanity countertop. Next stop, the lower level, and there's a whole lot to see here. Like this private gym here or some of the amazing playrooms for the kids. And let's not forget the extra guest bedroom and a private state-of-the-art theater. When you walk in, it definitely feels more of a home and less as an event space, which a lot of larger homes tend to feel like. With the current asking price just over $9.9 .9 million, this estate will truly leave you feeling like royalty. The next property is in one of Brooklyn's most sought after neighborhoods. And can we talk about the master suite for just a minute? It literally takes up an entire floor of this townhouse. The property also has a roof deck that has amazing views of the city that never sleeps. This house is the epitome of luxury living. From the moment you enter 181 President Street in Brooklyn, you know you're in for a treat. Not only does it have classic aesthetics sprinkled throughout, but it contains all of the conveniences of modern day. Aside from the soaring ceilings and the inviting fireplace, this nearly $10 million home features floor-to-ceiling glass doors that bring the outside in. You have these gorgeous, retractable accordion doors that open up to this incredible outdoor space. An outdoor great room, if you will, entertain on your private terrace with a pergola and built-in seating. On the terrace area, you have a gorgeous kitchenette. And if you're looking to dine indoors, the chef's kitchen certainly has you covered. The kitchen is always my favorite part of any home, and this one is a beauty. It features quartz countertops, top-of-the-line appliances, and how cool is this? The best feature in this kitchen is the integrated Wolf espresso maker, which eliminates the need for early morning coffee runs. And now it's time to see what the other floors have to offer. And while you can always take the private elevator up, here on President Street, you might want to get your steps in because the striking staircase is a true work of art. That staircase is pretty incredible. It leads us to the fourth floor of the home, a floor that is dedicated solely to the master suite. Yes, the master bedroom is so grand that it takes up the entire floor. We're currently in the lounge area, which has refrigerated wine storage and a hidden sink for entertaining on this level. And of course, there are the views. On a clear day, you have beautiful views of Manhattan, but what's equally nice about this being the master is you have mainly northern exposure. So while it's bright in here all day long, it's never overbearing amount of light. The master bathroom offers a relaxing escape. Covered in marble, here you'll find a walk-in shower and soaking tub. 
The floors are radiant heated, which is really nice when it's chilly and cold out. And how would you like to end your day taking in the city skyline on this rooftop terrace? It has views of all of downtown Manhattan in addition to the Brooklyn Bridge. And what's really beautiful about being on the roof is in the nicer weather, you could smell the sea breeze coming off of the water. A suburban lifestyle that steps away from the city that never sleeps. Coming up on Luxury Living, take a tour of Tuscany without leaving the tri-state. This home will certainly make you feel like you are part of Italian aristocracy.